Okay, I'm brushing out the uh, keyway, the existing keyway. I'm actually just making it larger. It was eight millimeters, so I'm making it three eighths. Now I don't have to put an extra one in, and uh, I made one light one pass already, which looks like it's going to work out. And it's going to take out 90% of the uh, beat up edge, so it's going to. I think it's going to work out. I'm just showing you. I'm using an anchor lube on it. This is kind of nice. This anchor lube. Uh, you know, you paint it. I just paint it on there with a brush, and it stays where you put it. So as that brooch goes through, it has lube all the way. This takes a while, so I'm just going to show you a little bit, but because using a hydraulic press, you got to and I have hand pump it here. It takes a little while to do all this. I got to make it go down as far as I can. Then I have a pipe I put underneath it to bring the spacing up and do it again. But it looks like it's working pretty good, so we're going to go with the 3 8 keyway. Normally this side shaft has a quarter keyway. But even at eight millimeters is larger than a quarter inch keyway. So going to three eighths is, isn't gonna hurt anything. So the inch and inch and a half, it's gonna be a little little over an inch and an eighth shaft, so All right, we'll just keep going with this and uh, come back when we're done. Here's my riser, a piece of uh, three inch pipe. Okay, I'll set it up here for, get set up here for one more pass. All right, I got two wedges that are going in. I even put some of this lube on that wedge that slides against the brooch. It uh, helps it slide a little easier. But this is a... You see, I'm just painting it on here, just making sure it's coated good. Okay, we got it done being broached there. It uh, looks really good in there. I'm gonna knock this out. Now this was a one and an eighth inch bushing. So what I did, since this is not one and eight, this is a little bit bigger. Just made a nice, perfect fit by wrapping a piece of shim stock around it. I just wrapped that, made that go right around there, and that made it a perfect, just a perfect fit to go in there. Now, yes, this might not be exactly the right depth. Uh, it might be a little shallow because, you know, you're shimming in the back and it's pushing it over to cut the right depth. Well, I have the flexibility uh, to, I'm going to cut the key on the shaft, I'll make it probably a little bit deeper. Or I can fine tune the key even. I'm not too worried about the, uh, this is like, 
I don't know, ten thousandths. Somewhere I got something to measure with. What is this? I don't know. This is ten thousandths. So, you know, being pushed back ten thousandths isn't going to make a lick of difference. So, anyway. See if I can uh, show you what it looks like and how almost all of the beat up part is now gone. I'm going to try to hold that so you can see in there, but Let's see if I can get a light down in there, but. There's hardly, hardly anything left of the part that was beat up. Just a little bit on that one side there. So, we're going to call that good. And when I get the uh, rotor back, we'll be taking care of it. This is the brooch set, set I brought, bought a Dumont Company LLC brooch, Minuteman brooch. Greenfield Mass, DuPont.com. A very nice, it came out just great, bought it on sale. Uh, Inco was having a Halloween sale. So got a pretty good deal on that. And it's brand new. So that's what I used. We got a bunch of rain on the day before yesterday. And it got cold, and we got snow on the mountain here uh, that's pretty close to us. This is actually quite close. That's a signal peak, it's called up there. There's a fire watch over there on that right hand side of it, the peak. It's a little over, it's been over 7,000 up there. So, we got our first uh, snow of the season. That's what we get, uh, that's our view from our house. Is the, we get a look up at the mountain there. It's pretty nice. And there's the horse. That's Blaze. He's about as lazy as Roscoe. Yeah, not really. He's actually very energetic. He's an Arab. He's very, very good horse. Uh, very nice. He's probably more hungry than anything else right now. Anyway, so... That's the view from our house, uh, beautiful mountains up there.